Hey everyone, welcome to the channel where you'll find travel tips and guides that won't waste your time. I'm Chad and I love exploring new places and sharing my experiences with you. Whether you're looking for the best spots to visit, the cheapest ways to travel, or the most fun things to do, I've got you covered. On this channel, you'll find short and sweet videos that will help you plan your next adventure. Florida is known for its beautiful beaches and warm weather. With over 800 miles of sandy beaches, there is no shortage of places to relax and soak up the sun. Whether you're looking for a quiet getaway or an action-packed vacation, Florida has something for everyone. In this guide, I'm running down the top 10 best Florida beaches you simply can't miss. The gallivanting starts now. New Smyrna Beach. With 17 miles of sand along the Atlantic, New Smyrna Beach is the place you need to be if you love to surf. Whether you're a beginner or a pro, you can find a wave that suits your level here. Jimmy Lane Surfing Academy and the oldest surf shop in town, Nichols Surf Shop, provide lessons. Leading to the ocean on Flagler Avenue are a number of art galleries, shops where you can pick up a souvenir, or places where you can grab a bite to eat or a drink. I recommend The Breakers, a legendary spot known for its hamburgers and ocean views, while Cafe Verde is great for organic and vegan dishes. Don't leave the area before paying a visit to the Ponce Inlet Lighthouse, the tallest lighthouse in Florida and one of the best preserved in the nation. Wear comfy shoes, it's 203 steps to the top. Casa Grill. The beaches of St. Pete Clearwater are famous around the world, but if you're looking to avoid the crowds, head south to the small, colorful community of Paso Grill. This historic beach town has one of the most pristine and uncrowded beaches in the area thanks to the lack of high-rise resorts. Take a boat tour or fishing charter from Mary Pier, or enjoy a day of swimming, sunbathing, and shelling on the beach. Some of the popular places to eat include Cozy Breakfast and Lunch Cafe The Seahorse, Shadrach's, a casual restaurant that specializes in pizza and sandwiches, as well as Grace Restaurant, a fine dining establishment with a rooftop bar. Hollywood Beach Hollywood Beach is a seaside vacation destination located between Miami and Fort Lauderdale. The highlight is the extensive two and a half mile broad walk, allowing you to enjoy the beach without ever getting sand between your toes. Here you'll find a number of eateries, bars, ice cream parlors, and live entertainment. Hollywood is also home to the Hard Rock Hotel that features more than 460 rooms across its three towers, one of which is the iconic guitar-shaped building. This hotel is one of the hottest night spots in South Florida with a casino, more than a dozen restaurants, 20 bars, and a concert venue. Fernandina Beach Located on Amelia Island just north of Jacksonville, the beaches in Fernandina Beach are less crowded than some of its neighbors. The beaches at Fort Clinch are a hot spot for hunting shark teeth and enjoying the sunshine. One of our favorite stretches of sand in this area is Big Talbot Island, 
in what's become known as Boneyard Beach. The striking landscape is peppered with massive driftwood trees that recall images of an elephant graveyard. The historic Victorian-era buildings in downtown Fernandina are full of eclectic and independent shops as well as dining experiences and art galleries and vintage stores. A huge seafood festival is held downtown every spring. Navarre Beach Navarre Beach is a scenic community in the Florida Panhandle with sugar white sands and emerald waters. One of the top attractions is the 1500 plus foot pier, the longest in Florida where anglers can cast their lines and enjoy the views. You can also visit the Sea Turtle Conservation Center or have a snorkeling adventure at the Marine Sanctuary's three different artificial reef areas. St. Augustine Villano Beach While St. Augustine is beloved for its history, it's also got some beautiful beaches. In addition to family-friendly St. Augustine Beach, check out Villano Beach on the north side, a hidden gem with a retro vibe. On the southern end are the peaceful beaches around Fort Matanzas and Crescent Beach, one of the most unspoiled stretches of hard-packed sand in the area. Anna Maria Island Anna Maria Island is a captivating barrier island on the west coast of Florida, south of Tampa. In addition to spending time sunbathing at breathtaking spots like Bean Point, be sure to check out the local shops and restaurants on Pine Avenue or watch the sunset at Anna Maria City Pier. Head to the doctor's office at the end of the day, a craft cocktail bar with just the right prescription. Vero Beach Vero Beach is a coastal gem that has something for every traveler. You can stroll through the tropical paradise of early roadside attraction McKee Botanical Garden, admire the historic charm of Driftwood Resort, or indulge in luxury at the beachfront hotel owned by singer Gloria Estefan. A good variety of shops and restaurants make Vero Beach the perfect destination for a memorable getaway. Cocoa Beach One of Florida's most adventurous beach towns can be found on the Space Coast in Cocoa Beach. You can learn to surf by taking lessons at the Cocoa Beach Pier, watch a rocket launch at Kennedy Space Center Visitor Complex, or visit a museum dedicated to the Wizard of Oz. Coco is the nearest beach to the attractions of Orlando via the 528 Beachline Expressway. St. George Island a short drive from downtown Apalachicola, St. George Island has more than 20 miles of pristine beaches. It's a popular destination known for fishing, kayaking, boating, and other outdoor activities. Standing at the center of the island is the Cape St. George Light, the fourth reconstruction of the historic lighthouse first erected in the 1830s. Grounds also include a gift shop and museum. There's a nominal fee to climb to the top. There you have it, the top 10 best beaches in Florida. I hope you enjoyed this video and found some inspiration for your next trip. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more travel tips and guides. Don't forget to share your own experiences and recommendations in the comments below. As always, thank you so much for watching. Stay safe out there gallivanting. I'll see you next time.